Welcome to Nameless Debate Radio, where radioactivity is contagious. You can join us in broadening our minds on the Nameless Debates Discord via the link below and even feature here yourself, if you've got what it takes. It is defined. Am I correct in that, Matt? Or in- yeah, dude, absolutely. Okay, so generally speaking, if we're, if we're just trying to get on the same page about what, and that's like, that's a, a, I'm saying generally to kind of prime the way that I'm trying to orient our minds together. Mm-hmm. Oh, ah, shit. That's all right, but just. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah. I, so I, is my kids. I, I, feel, I feel you on that. It's just that he said that what I was using. Oh, shit, I ranked up philosophically right he was saying that I that right I, I know but no one was getting to that point yet in a way Jordy you were jumping to a place that find sophisticated than we could jump to because we had to get the basics down first the generals and it's it's fine if you wanted to just kind of cut to the chase and be in the space where you're an expert but maybe some of us aren't and therefore we all have to try to find a way to know what the fuck w- word we're using as it's being used and it's usually starting out idiosyncratic. It's usually in some colloquial use, some more personalized, uh, the word I, I like to use is, is idiopathic. So, yeah, no, no, I, I understand. I understand that, right? And, and, and I, like, but here, the only, here's the issue that I have, right? Is he was speaking, right, from a, from a, from a position, right, that he was some authority, right? And then that he was- like, Was I? Somehow, so he was somehow he was somehow saying something that was um like I'm sorry, I was saying something that was happening that's contradictory or something to like the proper definitions, right? Because he even said, Oh, you probably you you obviously don't study philosophy. And I'm just like, Well, I'm using the philosophical terms and even if he wants to use the colloquial, sure. But it's like I, like first of all, don't um, don't act like condescending, right? When you don't when you're <laughs> talking out of your ass. That's well, what he's, he's not though, man. He was trying to get the general sense of it and you took the bait. And that's, that, that's how we as humans are. We either act or react or we try to rise above it and find a way to be a little bit more cause over our interactions. Like you could call me any number of words that would try to entice me to feel insulted. It's my, I would be the one that would be in the wrong if I then took your words as insulting. Because I can't know your intentions and you choosing to use a word. Like the claim that you want to imply you can somehow know the intentions of another as, as sophistic or not with the intent to uh-huh. mislead. That's, that's a real hard, uh, I guess, bucket to hold. And it's very leaky, that bucket. Because none okay. of us can know each other's intentions, right? I, I, so I get that point, right? But when you say something like, well, that's not the correct term of the word sophistry. And then try to Just say, in general. Oh, just in yeah. general. That's in yeah. the correct term yeah. in general. Yeah, yeah, but he was saying that I was wrong, right? And then using that, I was wrong by pointing to a time period that existed, you know, in during the Greek days, right? And saying that, well, this is actually what the term is. And I'm like, well, clearly words change over time, even in the For sure. sense, right? So that's, 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 that's why I said that, oh, was, that was sophistry, right? Because I, I feel just, like that's, I've... that's just you intending to, to try to make me look mm-hmm. stupid. Mm-hmm. Using Dude, you don't look stupid, though, is the thing. I've... So just don't take that bait. Yeah, I have a question, right? So, has the definition of sophist changed? Because I don't think it has. I know the word gay used to mean happy. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. <laughs> but, like... <laughs> Philosophical definition has changed over time. Just quickly, like, though, right? Definitely. So, when, when you say a sophist is someone who uses convincing but fallacious arguments, that what sophistry actually means, what it originally meant, is someone who argues not to arrive at truth or wisdom, but to win and persuade. Now, I'm sure you can see how those definitions are consistent, but your definition is superficial. It doesn't explain why it's occurring. Like, like even that right there, like, do you think that is like an attempt to argue against my point? Or you're just trying to assert some type of like, or Excuse trying me? to make a perception, right? Of that you have just some supreme intelligence trying to make me look no. like devalue what I'm saying. Look, like, that's clear what no, you're No, mate. Oh, God, shut up for a second. Listen, okay? When <laughs> I said sophist, <laughs> when I said sophist, Dude, all right, what I was referring to was the simple fact that a sophist is not necessarily someone who has bad intentions. 
You implied that it was. That is that is actually a sophist. No, it isn't. You can yes, be a sophist is. without meaning to. No, 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 no. Yes, you okay. can. Okay, okay, so... So, so what, are you trying to say he's being a bit of a, what, contradicting passive-aggressive asshole? Or... Who, me? No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm trying to figure out what you're saying. Are you saying he's speaking from an undeserved position of, um, like, intelligence? No, no, of, no. Um, I don't, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that he... Um, well, in terms of the conversation about sophistry, right? It's just like completely, like again, like zoom. It, when he says something like, "Okay, well, a sophist, right?" Isn't actually what you're saying because back during the Greek era, they used it in this particular way. It's just a fallacious way of arguing. I mean, that's just intending mm -hmm. to to be fallacious or so intending to saying, deceive. Sorry, wait, so intending to just intending to deceive specifically. Okay, but. Like, what fallacy am I using? Because I'm pretty sure I know what fallacy you think I'm using, and I'd be surprised if you could tell me. If I could tell you what fallacy... What yeah, fallacy you said it's using? fallacious reasoning. Name yeah, the so, fallacy. Yeah, so clearly, words are defined by their context, right? So appealing what? to a... No, I said name the fallacy. What, you're, what specific fallacy you're saying? Yes, correct. You're appealing to tradition. Okay, yeah, I'll accept that. Yeah, okay, but the All right, thing so is, why would you why would you accept that you're appealing to tradition as okay? Because uh, like appealing to the etymological origin of a word to explain what it means <laughs> like, now bro, is very reasonable. What are we talking about right now? Like this is so, so like when about. it comes to linguistics, appealing to etymology is a like that's an approved method in in linguistics. Dude, I thought you I said agree. Philosophy. Dude, that's just trying to be derivationally informed. Yeah, like that is a method in linguistics. It's valid. Right. All right, but here's the thing. We're talking about words in this specific context, right? That, this this context. is linguistics, right? Words bro, are linguistics, bro. right? We're not, about, we're not even talking about fucking linguistics, though. Right? Are we're words like, linguists? Mm. Like, are they, are they linguistic constructs? Dude, like, I'm not going to answer questions. Are they? Questions. I'm not gonna answer, answer the question. Dude, Somebody like, else ask him, please. Okay. See, and you see, you see, you guys see, like, just simply, like, he, he's, he's just trying to be a dick now, right? And this is somebody else thing. asking the question. It's perfect. Yo, nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Terrence, uh, um, I got, I have the Stanford Encyclopedia of Philosophies. Um, definitely here. I'll put, I'll put it in main. Yep. Yo, insane. Oh shit! Hold on. No, wait. It's not one to copy. So, um, one second here. Eddie, if um, you're available, I'd love it if you could ask the question for me. Our I'm doing a diaper right now. Dude, oh, good. hold on. There we go. Okay, okay, it's in Maine. This is uh, from Plato. Mm -hmm. Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. Um. All right. <coughs> Sorry, I have a cold. So, so, yeah, as far as I can tell... Like, I, I know Instinct's intentions fairly well, man. And uh, his, general, his general tone is to find a way to get on the same page when we use words. And I spent several years with him trying to get that way. And when he asks you questions, it literally is just to try to find out what logic you're basing your arguments on. So if it feels like he's leading you to a place where you're going to have to kind of make a decision one way or another, where you are just trapped in a yes or no box. Yeah, it kind of feels like that. But I assure you there's no real evil intent or malicious sophistry going on in the background there. It's just we will all probably have a little bit more clarity if we understand what point of view it is that you're trying to argue for and the way that you inform your perspective. Yeah, so like I get all of that, right? My, okay, so my, could you ask the question my, for me, Eddie? My, my yeah, what was the question again? The question was, are words linguistic constructs or not? I mean, I think that they are, but yeah, do, what do you so, think, Jordy? Are words I mean, linguistic clear, concepts? Clear, clearly, yeah, they are. Like, I just don't, I don't want to go down this route. Okay, so then... Just well, quickly, quick, I, I see, I kind of see Jordy's point here. Is, are, I mean, are you, are you trying to say is he's, he's doing that... Um, Kind of trap debating kind of thing where uh, yeah, it's called he gets the you to method. agree to a series of definitions of a no, word it's the Socratic and method. Can, then use your own logic against you. I just really it's the Socratic I just method, like, man. I just feel like this is just irrelevant to go down. I don't care about arguing. It's the Socratic right. method. I understand what it is, right? I don't want to. Go I don't down think you do. Road. If you say it's irrelevant, the Socratic method is the only way we have ever come to know anything. Oh my god, dude, dude, you're not Jesus listening. Fucking you're not Christ. getting what I'm saying. So, right? Jordy, why I'm, why don't you want to go down this road, man? 
No, no, I don't even want to argue about whether words are linguistic constructs, obviously. Like, I just don't care for it, right? I'm not saying okay. I don't want to, I don't, I'm not saying I don't want to, um, you know, just talk about this, go down a Socratic method, right? I'm not saying I don't want to do that. I'm just saying okay. I just don't care for talking about this, right? Uh, my simple contention, right, was that he was getting on him, on the other dude, I forgot his fucking name, right, about using the word on a, like, and he was talking about the actual standard definition, right? And uh, specifically that he was using incorrectly and he was getting on him being being on how I took it very condescending on him. So I then, again, being fair to the conversation. So you white knighted him. him. <laughs> so, I, so I what? You white knighted him, bro. I didn't white knight anybody. It's just yeah, you did, man. Fair. No, 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 no. Okay, that's defending. not common. Okay, so uh, but I mean, him white knighting, even if he did white knight, that doesn't invalidate his point. I agree. I never said therefore. Okay, so, so why say? <laughs> um, it's an observation about what happened. Okay, but, but it's an unneeded observation. observation. In the I don't care. I, I thought it was relevant. Oh, no, well, aren't ad hominem attacks against the rules? I'm just. <laughs> it's not an ad hominem attack. I made an observation about what happened. Oh, it wasn't about his character. All right, okay, let me see so if I can. Listen, dude, guys. listen. I did not call him a white knight. I said he white knighted. If I say he oh, murdered, bro. I'm not bro, calling him a I'm murderer. Saying? I'm making right. an no, observation. But, okay, so this is a very valid way of comparing how specific he uses words. Like, if let, let me see if I can reset this as well. Like, I didn't murder anyone. Talking... I murdered them. <laughs> no, dude. No, like, I said I'm we... not calling you a murderer as if that characterizes you as a person. But if you murdered someone, I'm perfectly justified in remarking he murdered someone. It's just like saying someone farted, but they're not a farter. Pretty it's, much. It's like we're just trying to find a way to not like get so wrapped up in the argument where we are identifying with these abstractions unnecessarily. So let me see if I can reset the whole stage here. Are we talking about the difference between minarchism and, and capitalism? I'm not even that having this. What we were talking I wasn't about, even talking Jordy, about this. Yeah, Jordy wasn't here for that. He came in halfway ah. through and thought he understood. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> okay. You thought a little hurt, my my dude. Like you good? Wow. Well, yeah. You got me, dude. I'm so butthurt about this. <laughs> All right. I'm just saying, you sound a little sick, bro. Sorry, yeah, right, bro. If you say so, man. Well, what do what do we want to do in terms of getting this back on uh, course? I don't or know, man. Like I thought. I thought. Like, uh, isn't the point of a dialogue that both people get to have a say about what's relevant? As far as I'm concerned, that is one of the ways the to. Avoid so, confusion. Yeah, for sure. So, like, when I was trying to engage him in the Socratic method earlier, and he mm -hmm. said he didn't care, that's not, he's not following the rules of argument because he has to care. When I'm talking, he's supposed to follow. Well, yeah. well here's the thing. I, when I say I don't care, I'm not saying I don't care about the Socratic method or having an argument. But you're saying you don't care about what I think is relevant, right? No, I just don't care about talking to you anymore. That's I don't give a shit. I'm trying to talk about the thing that I think <laughs> okay. is relevant. If you're okay. engaged but in I, a conversation I'm with me. I I'm saying I don't want to talk to you anymore. That's what I'm saying. Oh, okay. So you're saying you don't want to engage with me. Clearly. Why it's not? Because I don't want to. What do you mean, why not? Like, what do you I mean, it just sounds a little I'm... childish, that's all. It's not childish, bro. I just don't give a fuck. It sounded childish. I got a childish toss off you just then. Oh, that's your fault of... Because I don't want to! <laughs> no, I, I just think your interpretation was a little <laughs> fallacious there. So okay. if, I, if I said someone's actions were pedophilic on this server, and then I was accused of making an ad hominem attack, and I said, no, I didn't call him a pedophile, I said his actions were pedophilic. Is that still yes, an ad so hominem I'm, attack? So or is that not? Just to be clear with you, man, an ad hominem attack involves only addressing their character in an attempt to make their argument look wrong. Now, when I said he white knighted, I wasn't trying to say because he white knighted he was wrong. I didn't say anything of the sort. So, I mean, at any time you defend anything, you're white knighting something. I mean, no, no, you're not. White knighting has a specific definition. It means you're deciding that someone else deserves to be defended, but that they couldn't do it themselves. So you're being a white knight, and you're coming to save them. That, that's that is what you're, that, That's what it means. I'm kidding. <laughs> so I mean, I mean, are personal insults still out? I'm not sure. It's not a personal insult. It was an observation. Yeah. If someone on the server had done something pedophilic, it wouldn't be an insult to say that they had done something pedophilic. Right. So, you, are you saying it's it's not an insult because it's an observation? 
Correct. So, so you spelling out your observation can't be in any way an insult. I didn't say that. But then, I mean, it's but possible you're... to take anything insulting. Well, sure, if you want to be it depends. Subjective like, really, right? whether or not yeah. it's an insult depends on my intention. My intention was to make an observation about your behavior because it helped us all to understand the course of the conversation. You said, sorry, let me, let me be clear. You said an insult is, is defined by having the intention to hurt someone's feelings? Yeah, the intention to offend, correct, yes. Yeah, if you're offended by something which was not intended to offend you, it wasn't an insult, even if you may perceive it that way. So, can I ask you a question? When you said, uh, when you said a statement that, like, uh, tell me what fallacy I was using, you probably can't even spell it out, or you probably can't say it. Was that an insult, or was that you legitimately trying to uh, give your observation? Uh, I was a bit of both. Oh, a bit of both now. Okay. Yes. So you can Okay, okay. But so I mean, you were, you're you're, you're assuming something there. Um, not you, Jordy. Um, yes, of course I am. You're assuming yeah, I, that he can't define it or read it. No, but as soon as he did give me the definition, I backed off. Yeah, he instantly admitted it. <laughs> like, bro. So what's the problem, man? I just don't get it. What are you talking about? There's an ease. So in if there. you call someone a retard and say, "Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean it," later. No, like, dude, that, that is such a that's bad not, analogy. That's yeah. <laughs> and at the same Fucking time, terrible. someone's being slow. Like, think about it. Like, there's a way that we are all somewhat retarded here. Because... Oh, my God. <laughs> Man, come it's on. true. Well, like, I think you seem to be having a bit of a PC reaction here to the fact that he's offended. Wait. What do you mean? No, no, no. I'm not, I'm not. I'm not. I mean, wait, I mean wait, like, wait, you're wait, complaining wait. about the fact that my words might have offended him. Yes, well, I no, I'm, I'm not complaining that the words might have offended him. I'm just talking about the rules on here, you know? I mean, yeah, so I, the I, rules I, don't care. I don't care if people dude, are offended. Dude. But I care. I was if, like, you break like, the rules on a Discord that you're not. Just to be I'm clear, like, I was heavily involved in writing the rules for this server, man. Okay. I think I might know. Okay. Well, um, I mean, it did. I'm, I'm just there's saying, it looks like you might be violent. There's a difference. I'm sorry. Between, there's a difference <laughs> between an insult and something that's insulting. Do you understand? <laughs> Come on, man. Uh. If I make an observation about you that you don't like, that's true, that can be insulting. But if mm -hmm. I only meant to inform you of the truth, it wasn't an insult. So if I call you a retard, but I genuinely think you're a retard, but you take it as an insult, then if it's not really say, an insult. No, 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 look. No, 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 but I didn't mean it. No, I didn't mean it. No, dude, that's, 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 not, that's beside the point. It's a terrible point. example, okay? Yeah. Why is it a terrible I'll, example? To shut me. up. I'll tell you. I will translate your example into the correct terms, okay? If you say to someone, hey, have you ever been tested? Because I think you might actually be a bit slow <laughs> mentally, right? Even though that's insulting, if your intentions are good and you're actually checking with them, because you think that they might deserve to know, you are not insulting them. Okay, so if I say, I think you're retarded, because I genuinely no, think you're retarded, you say, and I don't say, mean it as an insult, but I don't mean it as an insult. No, it's fine. No, by your definition, it's fine, because okay, I don't but, mean it but, as an insult. But, no, but we agree, no. though, right? That you, making that assumption with a very limited amount of information isn't very fair. So wait, making an assumption with a limited amount of information is not no, an with insult. A with a very limited amount of information isn't fair. Okay, well, you made that. You made an assumption earlier with a yes. limited amount of information. No, but I, well, I didn't feel like the amount of information I had was so limited that it wasn't justified. Well, I think oh, you're wrong. So, wait, wait, yeah, wait, okay. Wait. No, no, but the thing is, obviously, I was wrong in that instance. That's why right. I retracted it as soon as he demonstrated it. Okay. But so, the fact of so the matter is... if you say is, I didn't mean it, then it's not an insult. No, that's not God. no, dude. You're you're kind of like sidestepping the point here. It's no, I I think you. I think actually he's getting on in in interesting. Jordy, here, Jordy, right? is that Jordy? Come on, just let's just what let someone mean? and visionary. No, I want to hear Jordy. Come on, don't don't. Yeah, why yeah, can't I, I mean, Jordy? Jordy. 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 Yeah, go for it, Jordy. Are you mad? Are you mad or something, bro? You don't like my voice. <laughs> no, man, I just think you, that, like, you're going to defend yourself. I don't think your opinion is going to be that relevant. Well, why is that my opinion relevant? If because you're, you're going to defend yourself. That's no, what no, people no, he's do. derailing. It's a prediction. Jordy, I, I it's actually just really want to hear what you were going to say. Yeah, yeah. So what he's getting at is fundamentally, right, is that, well, saying something insulting, right, is still in any way 
it's a bad way of arguing. It's a it's a out of bad. It's 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 just like you're not being sometimes. You're not giving respect. No, I don't want to hear something. Sometimes. I don't want to hear you try to make some super convoluted argument. Like I'm 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 just saying. Okay, well, yeah, I, right? I found that insulting, man. How dare you? <laughs> yeah, right. but here's a here's a difference. Though, right? <laughs> no, no, dude. Like, wait, where's your effective communication wait, at? Can I? Can I talk? Like you. No, I want to. I want to. I want to hear I mean, the rest you're of Jordan. Insulting me, though. Man, dude, you have a real. Thing, buddy. You have like a. You have like a real like problem. Like speaking, <laughs> you, you need like medication, bro. Dude, he's joking, man. Like, just go on with your argument. No, 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 no. All right, but but here's the thing, though. I can't. So I can't say certain things, right? And he can. But when he no. says it, like he's just joking. Like, come on. We're kind of well, like. No, I I was making a mockery of your position by using mm-hmm. it on you. So wait, yeah. mocking isn't insulting. Or making a no, mockery. I said it okay, is, mockery. but the point is, not is what we're arguing about is whether or not it is ever appropriate to insult someone. If he insults me, he contradicted himself. Right, and also we're also we're demonstrating the behaviors that we're talking about, and then like meta observing what we're all thinking about as they're happening. Like it's pretty fucking convoluted in here, regardless. Just that base level analysis. So like. It's fine that we all have different feelings and interpretations and perspectives about all this, but unless one of us starts to take the lead in a linguistic way, because that's the only fucking tool we have to navigate these waters in our mind, I don't know if anyone else has another option in like loose speech or tight speech. What do you want to oh, do? Much. Well, we're already not I'd going like, to come to the point. Look, just, it's so strange obvious. to me to hear someone mount an argument about how offense is never appropriate, insulting someone is never appropriate, but in the middle That's of that argument, argument he, he that said wasn't insulting, argument. insulting someone is never productive. That was the argument. That wasn't my argument. That was his argument. That's what he was saying. It's, okay, it, so it, it, he didn't say never. Listen, he said it's generally... Done. He said it could it's generally strange, be bad for a debate. It's to me... It's strange to me to hear a proponent of that position incorporate into the position an insult. No, no, no. Well, I was saying it actually to just give irony to the situation. Oh, right. okay. Fair enough, dude. That's, I mean, I understand that way. But yeah, go so, on. So, go finish your, your so point. In essence, generally, in a, and plus the, the fucking debate's over. So when in the debate, though, when you're talking, even the discussion, right, and you want to act, have this, like, very pompous attitude, it's just a bad fit, and in, uh, with the insult. Was that or was that not insulting? Okay, see, like, dude, dude, no, like, dude, dude, just answer, like, yes or no. Like, were you meaning to be insulting, yes or no? In what I said, pompous. Yeah, what about pompous. No, yeah, it only if you insult. take pompous okay. as an insult by your definition. No, we're not, dude. We're not talking about whether it wasn't. It wasn't, or not. it wasn't an insult. We're just mapping whether or not your intentions match your tone or like something to that effect. I don't know what's happening here, but. I'm trying yeah, to I know, yeah. fathom it. Personally, it's strange, right? When I hear someone call someone else pompous, it's usually an insult. Generally, no, I've found that to be true. But if it's not, that's fine. Continue. Do you, okay, do you feel like that wasn't a accurate or semi-accurate description of how you've been acting? I, I didn't say it, it wasn't accurate. <laughs> I said it sounded like an insult. <laughs> wait, 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 but that's just my observation, bro. Right. It's, 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 that's my whole point. It might even be valid, dude. It's We're just trying to figure it out. Like... Like how oh, you're using okay. these words. No, right, I, so I, I wasn't even arguing that it was bad. I was just arguing if it violated the rules or not. You know. Okay. So, I mean, ad hominem. Ad hominem is more using an insult and saying. You guys are deconstructing so insults, guys. What the fuck is happening? Yes, it's almost like this is a debate channel, and that's the whole point of it. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <That's, laughs> leave then, if you if you get mad about it. I don't well, care. Yeah. Um, yes, if I call you. Yeah. Um, yes, if I call you. Being a hater, so, bro. So can I ask you a question? <laughs> if I if I call you ugly, stop arguing. It's a debate channel. If I call you ugly or retarded, can that just be an observation, not an insult? Man, if look, someone I is ugly, I mean. Covered this. <laughs> okay, well, because so, I'm just giving you the logical consequence of your your. No, uh, no, no. Definition. But I think who's it? Like someone who is not me it? already presented the retarded argument. It's dealt with already. Hey, that's what you called my argument retarded. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kidding. <laughs> It, that was an insult. That was. Yeah, I'm going down. <laughs> See, that was the trap. That was the trap there. So you could, when yes. you refer to it later, it's quite clever. Did you just call that argument a trap? Are you assuming it's sexual orientation? Down, down. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> that makes it even better. Okay, how about this? Are traps gay? I wonder. It's a good question. Yeah, it is a good one. No, I, I fundamentally disagree with the proposition that insult is never productive in a debate. I don't accept that. 
Okay? Sometimes, when someone is being stupid, it is productive to make fun of them a little bit so they feel embarrassed. Would you, would you, how about this? Would you agree that, um, insults in a debate can be a bit of a slippery slope? Yes, you know, I, um, I think so, yeah. Because, yeah, because I don't think in regard to joking, making fun of someone or anything, I don't think I should Cause, be Because, yeah, a lot of the times, like, um, the, like the, most recently, the the presidential debates, I guess. Mm -hmm. You know, it would they kind of poke at each other, and then they poke a little more, and then they poke a little I think, more, and then it just devolves yeah, just to be into clear, a big pool of insults. So right. I mean, to be clear, maybe insults can be relevant in a, in an argument or in a debate, yeah. but it's once you no, start but, doing that, you get on the slippery slope. Look, just to be clear, I'm I think so. almost I'm almost exclusively referring to performative insults, right? So, for instance, if I discover that you don't understand epistemology. Usually what I do, if you're stubborn about the matter, is I demonstrate to other people how silly you look. Right? And so I am insulting you. I'm implying that you don't know what you're on about. I'm not directly saying it, but I'm definitely taking, an, like, making an effort to expose the stupid thing you're saying as stupid. Who is that? That's uh, Eddie's, Eddie's kid. Yeah, it's my kids. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, wow. oh, oh, yeah. balloon. That's basically what I'm saying, though. I'm saying, like, sometimes, like, make, like, <sighs> having something that makes someone else feel embarrassed can be very productive. It's, it's one of the types of uh, governing principles in an anarcho communist or capitalist society as well. Like, uh, whoever's familiar with Stefan Molyneux talks about the role of ostracism and dispute resolution organization. There's, there's a role that uh, ostracism and basically making people feel as though that they've done something wrong when it goes against the morals of the group. It's, it's a real difficult thing to articulate, but it can be done if people start mm -hmm. to pick up on the social cues as they're being evidenced in real time, which is what I think we're all doing yes. right now. Which is exactly, by the way, what you're doing when you're saying, well, you've insulted someone and that's not okay. Because I could take that as an insult if I liked. It's just that everybody has agreed that that doesn't count as an insult. Exactly. Right, because it's an observation about your behavior. If you're being insulting, even though the proposition that you're being insulting is in itself an insult, if it's true, it doesn't count. It should be something that you could admit to and move on from, or, you know, you get bogged down in a quagmire. Yep. Or maybe it's not true and you can test it and convince them that they were wrong. But exactly. the point is that they're not wrong to say it. Hmm. It's just the principle of free speech I mean, as far as I'm concerned. Even if an insult is true, it's still an insult. No, but that's not necessarily the case. That's what I'm saying. Is like when a nurse observes that you are too fat for your heart condition, you may well feel insulted. You may well perceive it as an insult. It was not one. Hmm. Why not? Because well, because their intentions are to help you. Hmm. But I mean, you can ignorantly insult someone. Still, you can. Of course, attempt, of course, you can. You can, to make, you can. Okay, so like um. I have but a in that in that case, right? Let's just deal with my thought experiment. Is it an insult? Hmm. To the person, yes. To you, maybe not. Yeah, but, yeah. yeah. I, no, but, I don't accept that it's an insult to the person. To think of it as an insult is okay. childish. Okay, I'm sorry, but <laughs> you should, I mean, you I would I would be consider that about what, like when you're when you're calling something an insult or not an insult, you need to be thinking about what the other person intended. If someone intended to help you but offended you, you should probably focus more on their intention than how you felt. So, so if there was ask a group, about the so, intention. So if, if there was a group of men, and then I said, I, "I women are stupid," and I didn't mean it as an insult, I meant it as a joke. And um, uh, everyone in no, the no, but the joke spent. relies on an insult. Don't we agree? But you didn't mean it. You meant it entirely ironically. No, no, no. Itself. But like, it doesn't work as a joke unless there is an insult in it. Hmm. <laughs> Trying to think of a better definition. I can't find one. Or a better analogy. I cannot find one. The, you might the point be right that here. I'm making is that, the, yeah, the comedy <laughs> inherently relies on the insult.
Oh. So, um, how about this? You refer to a black person as black. And, um, it's almost considered nowadays that black is an inappropriate word to use, mm-hmm. which I don't, I don't agree with that. But I don't agree with that either. That's how you grow up to a black... black Wait, what? Who says that? Okay, well, no, let's make it even worse. PC warriors have, do. Well, let's, let's say you have a black group of friends and you say, what up, my Nick, you know. Yeah. All right, but that's not using the word black. That's using. Okay, I, I know, but no. Let's say you don't. It's, it's analogous. I think. Let's say you mean the. Wait, no, the, 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 no, 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 no. I would say, uh, like, I can extend my argument to your analogy. If okay, what you're so so N-R-G-G-A. let's say you say it with an with an A as the buddy yes, definition. Yes, yes. If you mean it in a positive way, your intention is more important than how it's perceived. Even if it's perceived by the majority of people as yes, an insult. Yes, because here's the thing, is that the only way that that word will ever change from being a pejorative is if people use it as, as a positive. Okay, so if, I, um, so if I did that at school, I would probably get kicked out. You know, I'd probably yeah, maybe, get kicked but out you, of like, I, mean, I violated the rules. No, but I think that has more to do with the fact that you're a child, and children don't just get to do whatever they like. Okay, I, I don't mean child, okay, college. Let's say college. A college? I don't think you would. Oh well, um, I I think I would. Um, I it's mean, a it's I a publicly university. funded. It's a publicly I don't funded think, college. Yeah, but uh, like even if it's publicly funded, as long as you I, can I intellectually tell. look, as long as you can intellectually justify your choice of words, a, a university or at least one with integrity should never kick you out for that. Mm. Well, there are universities without integrity that yeah, I hundred percent believe would kick. No, you but out I would say you. that that's a problem with integrity, right? Hmm. Well, then you get into the argument of uh, who has better integrity, I guess. No, I'm saying, like, if it's an academic oh. institution, it should, by definition, promote freedom of thought and freedom of expression. Many don't. That's actually something I'm against. A lot of universities nowadays are like, hey, say what you want as long as it's like, um, as long as it, like, agrees with everything we say. <laughs> Yes, but like I said, I think that if the, if it contradicts the main idea of the institution, then it doesn't have integrity. Hmm. You make some fair points. My main. <clears throat> Unfortunately, I have managed to rouse my friend, so I am going to be leaving us in the next rouse. minute. Rouse? You have like a fuck buddy or something? No, he uh he was sleeping, and I wanted him to come over, but he was sleeping. Hmm. Yeah, and now now he has come over. Well, I gotta get going too. Got some bedtime for the kids. But this has been uh, mildly unproductive, yet nonetheless interesting. Yeah, I mean, it, it, I found that the. the the closer to the end of the conversation we got, the more productive it became, in my opinion. Same. Yeah, it, it just, there was so many, uh, so much cross-talking that yeah. <laughs> it was really hard to keep track of. Oh, dude, that was really hey, frustrating. What's oh, getting annoyed. oh, wait, I found it. I know everybody could hear me getting annoyed, because I'm a big cunt when I'm annoyed. Yeah, you, you get kind of cunty. Yeah. But, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but then people start jumping on that as well, and... Uh, yeah, it just, it's, I think that's the, the idea behind trying to keep things as uh, civil as they can. But yeah, even that doesn't really scrub the whole situation of the problems of conversation. Yeah, for sure. All right, guys, um, I will talk to you later. Later, Billy. Have a good one. <laughs> Take care, guys. Thank you for listening. Like, share, subscribe, and join us in the Nameless Debates Discord. We hope to see you there.